concept of rust and motion in daily life we come across so many objects some we say are trust some of them are in motion suppose we consider a ball is on the ground is it a trust or motion yes we say it is a trust a moving toy we say it is in motion rotating it about its axis yes this is in motion a clock on a wall it is a trust a moving bike it is in motion now what is rust what is motion one we can say an object is a trust one we can say the object is in motion an object is said to be a trust if its position does not change with respect to its surroundings with the time in this diagram as you are seeing this object is said to be a trust there is no change in the position of the body with the time with respect to surroundings suppose we consider this you can find the change in position of the body with respect to time now this object is said to be in motion an object is said to be in motion as long as its position changes with respect to its surroundings a body is said to be a trust if its position does not change with respect to its surroundings with time a body is said to be in motion as long as its position changes with respect to its surroundings with time as this idea is enough to define a rest of motion no this is not enough now we take this examples consider two persons a and b are in a moving bus c is on the ground if you ask about b to a then a says b is a trust if the same question you ask to c what about b then c says b is in motion related to same person b we are getting two answers one says he is in motion the another says he is a trust which of them is false no both are correct then why we are getting different answers yes with respect to a he is a trust with respect to c he is at motion that is the rust or motion are relative things they depends with respect to what we are considering